here at Phil's with Brianna. She's doing some CS, eating avocado toast. All the CS. Just got back from the coffee shop and it looks like I'm gonna make it. I have three minutes. I have my clicker so I can click in right when class starts. Gotten it close, but that was so worth it. Whew, I haven't seen Brianna in so long. I miss her so much. Hi, Bay. I made it on time. Chose D. Oh, wow. wow. It's super, super foggy because of the fire. And it smells a lot like burnt candles and stuff. Like everything is hazy. How close is the fire? Uh, I don't know if I know. It's in the Bay Area somewhere. It gives the the tower like a little little haze. So there is a fire in the North Bay Area, and it's making everything intensely hazy. And it smells like smoke everywhere. It's pretty absurd and hard to breathe. So look who I bumped into. <laughs> You're so cute. How was career fair? I had to put on contacts. And everybody else today was just like, let me wear like suits and shit. I'm like, I, why are you wearing suits? Because they want jobs. Yes, I want a job too, but I thought techie culture was like... Casual? Yeah. Well, <laughs> so Joseph is a CS major. Hello internet. Hello world. I'm making you CS exercise. Program? Follow me. Follow me. I was already exercising when I'm I I'm making the CS you. major <laughs> exercise. What do you think about this fire? You know, it's really, really sad. Yeah. And I hope that not. That, I hope that people will be okay. Yeah. And I really hope that people will also be okay because of asthma and like other respiratory diseases. True. Bong is that way. Okay. I'll just see go you later. down by. Just go to Roman. Oh my God. Now I'm about to go home myself up in computer science office hours for like six hours, so wish me luck. We out here, we just got out of CS office hours. I have to wake up at 5.30 a.m. tomorrow. <laughs> and I don't. And it's uh, midnight, basically. I am bundled up in the stupidest outfit, and I think I've reached my low point of fall quarter. I'm wearing a, a lab coat. It's like freezing, by the way. Um, a rowing splash jacket, a long sleeve, a quarter zip, and a t-shirt. And yeah, so this is currently life. We're gonna go eat food because I haven't had dinner. Now I totally understand why they say like CS kids like hold themselves up and like sleep in the buildings and stuff because like it takes so much time. And I should have started earlier, which I have learned my lesson. This is actually horrible. So it says pedestrian zone, do not enter. And there's some weird like, like, I don't even know, like tables and stuff. This is really sketchy. Do you see this? What are these? Like how sketchy this is. What are they planning to do tomorrow? Wow. They're preparing for some large feast. Now we're going to get late night. And hopefully not die. This is where all the cool kids go. Today has been a crazy, crazy morning. It is so smoky from the fire outside. Apparently like Napa and like the Bay Area is burning down. So we actually went to practice and just had to erg because it's impossible to race or to row in these conditions. You're breathing in smoke and it's horrible. But uh, today was like pretty rough because like I've been stressing about school and stuff, but I should declare my major today, which is good. And also I have a poster presentation which is like I'm presenting the research and stuff that I did this summer in Hawaii. Um, Mr. Ariaga, who is like one of Stanford's like biggest donors, he has like so many buildings named after him. Because we won national championships last year, we're invited to his house. And I can't go because I'm presenting this stupid poster. Uh, the poster presentation is supposed to be business casual, so I hope this is good enough. In case you're wondering, Smoke encompasses campus. Like literally, campus is completely fogged up. It's so hazy, it's so hard to breathe. And I guess I'll show you my poster. 
amidst my pile of clothes. Okay, so it's a little bit bent because it's been rolled up, but it's going to be flat when I present it. So this is what it looks like. Um, like what I did this summer, like the photographs that I took. And then it's kind of like photos that I've taken, like the different crops that we grew on the farm. Pretty cool stuff. I'm not really nervous to present, but I'm really bummed that I can't have to miss Mr. Ariaga's dinner because I was really looking forward to that. These are all the student posters. Now I have to choose where I want to put mine. Well, I found where I'm supposed to present. This is the saddest name tag ever. Here is my poster. So tell me a little bit about your research. I make solid polymer electrolytes for battery applications. Like I fed birth control hormones to rats and saw what it did to the tensile strength properties of their ACLs. I explored a 6th century Byzantine shipwreck and we dove for 3 hours a day and it was a lot of fun and I found a lot of cool stuff. These are so awesome. Wow. Virginia drove all across the US to sketch these amazing national parks. Hey Simone. <laughs> What do you know about stem cells? What do you think about when you hear stem cells? I think of regeneration in just about anything. Our lab was able to get make induced neuronal cells. They look like neurons, they act like neurons, they model diseases like neurons. So I just took my poster down and it is over. Wow, that was intense.